the darkness. And Nicholas is goofing around in the light. Gurgon Pitts is back, and as always, we are goofing, we are fucking up, and we are extremely amateur in what we are doing, but we will bring you the uh, kind of underground band of the week or of the month or so. We are, as you notice, we're trying to to be the uh, to be the next bloody 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 blah but didn't work. Uh, reciting from what I just did, um, moving on, uh, we are going to review an album that came out in 2012, and it took a long time, about 20 plus years, for this album to be completed, and uh, if you ask me, it was 20 years of probably miserable and very happy times. I mean, it must have been like 20 years of really defying the, shaping this album into what it is. And what it is, it's a true masterpiece, I would say. This is the album. You can only get it from the band, so you have to order it from uh, themselves, so um, we're going to put down a description. Jerketta, a legendary Pittsburgh uh, doom death metal band that uh, was uh, formed in 1988. If I remember myself correctly, what I read about them, Jerketta me is the blood drinking goddess of death of a Stygian cult. So, uh, kind of fits the idea of the whole album, I mean, the concept, which is a very dark, broody, gritty album. Starts off by hearing bells at, at the midnight, and you, you just have to listen to the album to, to understand how fucking amazing it is. So, <clears throat> without further ado, we're going to play the title track, which is my favorite. It's called In Death We Meet. <laughs> As you heard, it was crushing the, uh, 
the guitar tunes of the whole album is like this, and the tempo kind of variates from track to track. Some tracks are faster, some tracks are like slower and grittier, like this one. But in general, the whole album is like slowly getting crushed by stones. And the whole feeling of the album is just the perfect one for a doom death album of this magnitude. Um, they have connections towards uh, the band's incantation and uh, from what I've seen on the internet they have uh, been playing with uh, Massacre and uh, from what I've heard they've also played with St. Vitus Mino. So this is just the immense power of what Doom Death t is today. I mean, it's just really, really good Doom Death at all. So you really have to check this band out because they are amazing. Really, really amazing. I got a hold of uh, the demo tape a few months back and I was, I was, I was mind blown that I did get it for so cheap. Anyhow, <clears throat> take it away, Niklas. You can pick the apple, but the apple can not pick you. The apple really should, has a bad deal here. I mean, if I was an apple, I would want to pick somebody. But, or pick on somebody, maybe. But, but if the apple falls on your head? I seek you to. Oh, yes. That was a badass apple. The apple that fought back. There we have it. So that's uh, all from Gurgling Pits, uh, Dirk Yada in Death We Meet. Uh, there's a description to where you can buy the album. And uh, uh, Niklas is currently selling his old socks on the internet, but uh, due to um, due to the fact that they're Niklas used socks, um, he will not sell them anymore. Because he was asked not to. Of Holger. Oh yeah. So, all of you, get bucked. <laughs>